is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Tiger Financial News Network, 10 a.m. market update. Basil Chapman here on this Tuesday, the 15th of Feb. We come straight off to Tommy O'Brien's market kickoff. Great show. Start your day at 9 o'clock. So we're looking at the Dow 304, a little amelioration of the uh, situation over in Russia and Ukraine. Uh, oil has come down sharply. Market is responding very well. But there's still the Fed speak to, to worry about and inflation, etc. So what we're looking at here is the Dow is up 305 at 34,863. My impression has been that we're going to make an H formation or like an arch that stops near the 200 period moving average and then try tries to rally again and if it's able to that's going to be really important if there is a failure going under under 34,100 in the Dow that's going to be a big deal look at the S&P so the Dow is up a 0.9 percent the S&P is up 1.14 percent up 50 at 44.51 same pattern we spoke about this trading band I said between the 45.95 area and the somewhere around uh, yesterday's low was a tad lower than I anticipated, but I had drawn in at about that level. So the low of 43.64 is going to be absolutely imperative to hold. So we'll see if this by Thursday, we've got to get through Wednesday. If by Thursday, the S&P is up towards the 40, I'd say the 40, 40, 505 level that'll be fantastic looking at the qqq this has got a better percentage it's up 1.8 percent at six up 630 at 353 it's got a lot of work to make up it's got all that resistance of the 356 area we'll see if it's able to do that get to the 358s by thursday because if it takes out yesterday's low, that's a bad thing. IWM, same thing. It's up 1.68 percent, up 3.38 and 204. The big story is that gold, uh, gold um, is down 20 dollars at 18.49. Made a new recovery high. Now pulling back sharply. Same as crude oil because of the amelioration of all the uh, tension over uh, overseas. And now we're, what we're looking at is crude. This is the biggest red candle we've seen. Days young in crude is down 440 at 91.07. But really, what we need to talk about is the TLT making a new low today, down one at 135.53. Yields are going higher. I'll be back for my Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. There's a lot to discuss. And I also want to show you a couple of patterns that we're looking at and the importance of the 200-period moving average. We'll be back in a